Hello and welcome to another video. I am so excited to share today's photo shoot with you as we are at one of the most beautiful locations in all of the Netherlands, the Purple Heather Fields. These fields are a photographer's dream and stretch on for miles. They have a relatively short blooming period though and only bloom at the end of summer from mid-August to the beginning of September. So I'm so excited to be here and utilize this natural beauty for today's photo shoot. My name is Teresa and let's get started. This is my lovely model, Sefta. She came a long way for this photo shoot and was so patient with me as I really took my time with these photos. Today's theme is dark fantasy with a little bit of dark cottage core mixed in. I wanted these photos to be quite dark to signify the end of summer. So we started off with some close-ups and as you can see, I'm coming from a higher angle to help eliminate the sky and get a purple background throughout the entire photo. I picked a small swig of the heather and held it in front of my lens really closely, uh, making sure it was only visible at the very corner of the shot. This is a little trick I do to add a little blur of color right in the very corner. Uh, it can also add depth, haze, and moodiness to a portrait, and it's something I do on a lot of my photo shoots, especially if it includes flowers. These heather fields are a part of a nature reserve where dogs are allowed to run freely off their leash and this handsome guy kept coming up to us during our photo shoot and honestly it was the cutest thing and I ended up getting a really cute unexpected picture for this series. Next, we pulled out one of my ball gown skirts. This thing is absolutely massive, and it's one of my favorite props in my arsenal because it's just so dramatic. So we just pulled it over Sevda's dress um, and kept the top of her original dress. This thing always takes a few minutes to get sorted out because I swear it has like 30 layers to it. And I got this skirt at Mr. Pretty Skirt, and I'll link it down below. One of my favorite things about this skirt is that whenever someone puts it on, they immediately start twirling it around, and they feel, I guess, like a princess. And I love that. So for these, we went out in the middle of the field, had her stand up, and swing the skirt around to create natural movement in the skirt. This is my assistant slash husband, and now we are trying to get a shot of the dress dramatically flowing in the wind. So for this, I needed him to help me throw the dress up into the air and then quickly back away. This type of shot always requires at least a few attempts <laughs> to really nail it. Okay, I do it really high. Ready? And go. For the last shots, I wanted to get a few more close-ups, but this time with the big poofy skirt all around her. Uh, and I think these ones of her sitting down made her really look like a princess to me, and they ended up being some of my favorite ones.
Thanks for watching! I hope you enjoyed seeing us create these photos. I'm really pleased with how they turned out, and if you'd like to see more, I have a blog post linked down below with more photos from this series. And please make sure to also follow me on Instagram to be the first to keep up with me and my newest work. Thanks for joining me on this dark fantasy photo shoot in the Heatherfields. I will see you all again very soon for another video.